We're now proud to introduce SpeakUp, Capgemini's best-in-class phone and web-based ethics concern reporting tool. Whoa, I'm glad I watched that. I'm sure I overheard my manager disclosing confidential information. Good to know there's a place I can get advice about what to do. Maybe I misheard. Maybe I didn't understand the context. But it definitely seemed wrong. On the other hand, I don't want to cause a problem with my manager. I should check out exactly how the SpeakUp works. You can access SpeakUp via global links on the Talent homepage or by navigating directly to the portal. Create a bookmark so you can always find the page easily. Choose your preferred language. Then decide if you want to report an incident or ask for advice. If you prefer, you can speak to someone over the phone in your local language. Select your location to get a local phone number. Choose Report an Incident to raise a concern about an incident you believe violated our ethical guidelines or rules. Select your location where the incident you wish to report occurred, and then click on Get Started. You will see a data protection and privacy notice in your language. It's important you read it in full before proceeding. Type your description of the incident in the box provided. Describe in detail what happened, where, when, and exactly who was involved. The more you share in the first report, the better it is for the investigation. You can add attachments if needed. Share your name and contact details. Don't worry, Speak Up ensures confidentiality. If you don't wish to share your identity, Speak Up allows anonymity, where local laws permit this option. Partial anonymity. This option allows you to remain anonymous toward Capgemini, in which case your identity will be shared only with Conversant. Complete anonymity. You can remain completely anonymous, in which case neither Conversant nor Capgemini will know your identity. Even if you choose complete anonymity, you can still opt to receive notifications. In either case, investigators will not be able to identify you, though they will be able to reach you to ask any follow-up questions. Before you submit your report, you will be asked to create a password and a security question. Keep a record of the reference number so you can track the progress of your report. Speak Up is not only for reporting an ethical incident, you can also ask for guidance or advice. As with the Report an Incident option, choose Ask a Question to go to a page where you can type in your query. You can choose the level of anonymity you want, where local laws permit this option. You'll be asked to review your question and create a password before you submit it. Speak Up will create a reference number for your question. Keep a record of it so you can track the progress of your query. Whether you've submitted a report or asked a question, you can use this section of the homepage to check its progress. Just enter your reference number and password. So glad I got some advice. I'm sure reporting it was the right thing to do. It's a big weight off my mind. The group prohibits retaliation against anyone raising or helping address a concern. Speak Up is neither a grievance helpline nor a platform to raise HR-related issues. For such issues, local grievance channels available in your respective geographies should be used. If a concern is about a matter that, under local law, may not be accepted by Capgemini through Speak Up, you will need to report it to your manager or HR, ethics, or legal departments. 